So once the operator has the points marked on the vehicle that they're measuring, we can access the Mitchell diagram and select the Matrix Active Map 3D tab. Once that tab has been selected, we can identify areas that are available for 3D measuring provided by the Mitchell diagram and compare them with areas on the vehicle that we're measuring. So this strut tower, I'm going to bind to point H on the Mitchell diagram. And you can see now that that strut tower is passenger side H. We'll do the same thing with the driver's side strut tower and these points at the front of the radiator core support. Once I bound all the points I'm interested in comparing, I'll go back to my original image, select matrix uh, active map XYZ measuring, and then I'll pair these points with the points from Mitchell. And we're creating a triangle right now, points that we believe to be trusted and undamaged. You can see that they agree fairly strongly. And now we're going to check this point that we believe may have damage. And in fact, this point has a nine millimeter positive match. So let's move forward. It has a seven millimeter negative sway. So it's moved towards center line. And it has a three millimeter sag. So it's three millimeters lower than our 3D data says it should be. And we can document this very easily. And this document can now be attached to the appraisal or printed out right here on the cabinet or just saved in a file for later. It's that easy.